yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a little storybook, right? You know, you got got a former pit player, a guy who's been uh, very connected to the program in many different ways, and, you know, we're looking forward to the opportunity to just, uh, you know, send them home in advance. You both were local guys, right, that got to come to play to pit, a little right. bit of a connection there between you and him. Right. You know, I, I know he played a pit before you were born, but yeah, yeah. did you get to call up any highlights of his when he played there and was making NCAA tournament teams? Yeah, so, I mean, my dad's told me more about him. Obviously, it wasn't, it's not, like, there's not a ton on social media from that time, just because, like, it's that time, but, you know, what comes to mind is obviously the drop off the drill lane. Um, yeah, I've heard a lot about, you know, you know, the Miller family is pretty prominent around Pittsburgh basketball. So, you know, I've definitely, definitely heard about them since I've been growing up. You were talking about, about Nelly there. Yeah. Nelly obviously has that connection with him too. I mean, right. for you two to be homegrown kids, to be able to do this for Pitt, how much more special does that make this run? I mean, it's unbelievable. It's just, uh, we've seen the ups and downs of the program and being able to be a part of the team that brought it back and, you know, he, I remember him mentioning he had his first AU practice ever in the Pete. I used to do the little dribbling panthers at the halftime games of the Pete when I was, you know, five years old. So it's pretty cool that we're in the, we uh, were able to bring it back in the same building.